Rod Stewart, 77, has had a turbulent relationship with fellow singer Elton John, 75, over the years, and his latest prank live on stage may not go down well. The Maggie May hitmaker was pictured sitting on a bench, playing an air piano, while sticking out his teeth in Elton-inspired clothing. Rod took to Instagram to share the funny prank with his one. 2 million followers with a video and picture. The singer impersonated Elton live on stage in a bright blazer with a bold purple and pink floral print. He wore a similarly patterned white shirt underneath, paired with side stripe trousers. Rod added to the Elton inspired look with a pair of his signature round frame glasses. In the video, Rod can be seen mimicking the Your Song hitmaker with his hand gestures and facial expressions. He captioned the cheeky Instagram post, Still love you, Elt. Rod 30. Throughout the pair's 50-year careers, they have had their fair share of public disagreements as well as commenting on each other's career ventures. This began in the 1970s when Rod promoted his Blondes Have More Fun tour with billboards around the nation. In response, Elton placed billboards around with his own face on them, reading, But brunettes make more money. However, their humorous digs at each other came to a halt in 2018 when Rod shared his opinion on Elton's upcoming farewell tour. Rod said Elton's proposed tour was dishonest and stunk of selling tickets during an interview with Andy Cohen. Elton, visibly shocked and angered by the comment, blasted publicly shortly after, I thought he had a effing cheek, complaining about me promoting a tour while he was sat on a TV show promoting his own tour. This led to Rod trying to mend the damaged friendship as he publicly apologized, admitting he was bang out of order. Elton also commented on the distasteful comments in his 2019 autobiography Me, telling his fans that he wouldn't take lessons in rock and roll from someone who'd spent most of the last decade crooning his way through the great American songbook and have yourself a merry little Christmas. The rocky relationship was still not fully mended by 2021, with Rod telling the PA news agency they still weren't on speaking terms. When asked if the pair would ever collaborate, Rod smirked, no chance. Scotland has got more chances of winning the, soccer, World Cup than that ever happening. He continued, we don't talk at all now. If we talk, we do it through the press. I will say something and the press will pick up on it. He will say something and the press will pick up on it. I don't even think I have got his mobile number anymore. Explaining their up and down relationship, Rod said it has been going on for years but thinks they both still adore each other.